Mark for asking me the question. He was asking uh, what trap goes best where. As I talked about the disadvantages and the advantages of different traps. But if you look at um, floating thermostatic, it's, uh, I said before there is no universal steam trap, but they're, um, the one closest to being universal where I'd say the most versatile would be the FMT, the floating thermostatic traps. You can use those on coils, heat exchangers, unit heaters, jacketed vessels. Uh, the one thing to remember is modulation. Anything where the flow isn't constant, where the pressure can vary, uh, the FMT trap is probably your best choice. You can also use them on, uh, we'll see them a lot on uh, humidifiers. They can be used on the separators of humidifiers. Inverted buckets are typically on uh, drip applications. The drips are the end of lines or anywhere there's a steam trap in, within the, along a steam main. Those are drip points to get rid of the condensate that builds up in the main. Uh, they can also be used on unit heaters, but I prefer to use an FMT. Anywhere there's an on-off. Thermodynamic, um, in this, this area, in this market, typically only for drip applications, anywhere it's on-off. And the balanced pressure thermostatic, these ones here, are mainly just for steam rads. There are still a few steam rads around, not as many as there used to be, but there still are. I've tested enough to know that uh, they still exist.